Guys, it's finally happening. We're riding Air Force One today. Can you believe it? <laughs> that was more of a yawn. <laughs> it's today. It's opening day one, and we're driving. It's about 7:15. We've been up for about an hour and a half. I'd say I've been up for about an hour and a half. So yes, it's been an early morning, but I just can't believe we've been waiting almost two years for this. Did you even sleep last night? I did sleep you last did. night. That's a surprise. Yeah, I, I know. I, I did. It's actually just, it's been two years that I've been waiting for this since they announced that they were building an RMC and then they officially announced it. I've been tracking the construction like basically every week. This is actually just crazy that it's happening. I'm just so excited. So, well, we're already on our way to the park, so I'll see you when we get to the park. Gotta love Atlanta. I mean, the traffic's not actually that bad, but... Yeah, it's still traffic. Yay. It's not that bad. It'll only be about seven minutes, it says, but still. Okay, it's trees, 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 still trees. Oh, still trees, still trees, and massive roller coaster. Look at that. We're going to be it soon. Whoa. It's so much. That's actually Wait, crazy. Harry we'll Force One now open. Oh my gosh, Wait, it's so good to see that. Michaela, it just dropped. Yeah. Uh, can I get it? All right, so you're gonna go go down to get there. the big tree, make left where Mel's at, okay. and they'll point you over to where the parking is. Awesome. That's All right. Thank you. Wait, oh, All right. Have over. fun, guys. Have we fun. will. We got some Wait, excited photos. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I think it's pretty clear by now, but yes, we've made it to Fun Spot. What do you think of your first impressions of Harry Force One? I have to pee. <laughs> okay. Uh, you can see over there the parking lot. If can you see they're using the parking lot over there? Gotta get, Gotta get out of the road. Oh, there's some cars over there in the parking lot. If you can see that over there, nice. That they have not fixed this parking lot yet. I wonder if they'll ever do that. But it is crazy to finally see really Air Force tall. One. It is really tall. It is crazy to see this. You are really, yeah, wow. We are on a hill. This is just crazy. It's flying already and it's don't, 60 degrees outside. That's crazy. Whoa. Look, they have, already, they have signs everywhere. There's a sign right there. There was a sign at the front that I'll show you later. This is crazy. Michaela, do something. Need content. Okay. Their cool thing is that they have a bunch of, they put up a bunch of new signs. <laughs> They are right behind us. There, there's uh, some signs right here, and there's some stuff down there. There's new signs everywhere. Pretty cool. All right, so we just got our media things, or, or guest things. We're getting so close. We're right next to it. We're right next to it. I haven't been this close up. It's weird being this close because it's always, it's weird seeing this not blocked off anymore. And there's a sign right there. Oh, that's so cool. Here we go. Entering Air Force One. We just entered Air Force One. Holy crap. Oh, there it goes. It's going. Oh. That's crazy. Entering the queue. Holy cow. Okay. So, I'm going. This is cool. The train is right there. That's pretty cool. Whoa. Ooh. Snap. This is happening. This is actually happening. This is crazy. We're going up the stairs. Holy cow. All right, back row, back row. Back row. This is crazy. Hi. I'm going crazy right now. We are in the station. This is so cool. I'm so excited. Look who we found. What's up? What do you think? Guys first ride. What do you think? Unbelievable, not a dull moment on the entire ride. I don't even have a favorite element, I honestly. I told you to tell me nothing. <laughs> last night. So you wrote it last night. You keep night. setting me up. 
you, told, yeah. you wrote me. I, I, wrote I texted him and I told him not to tell me anything about it. And then I asked him if he wrote it, and he said, I. And, he, and then you said no words. And I was like. <laughs> Okay, did you write it? So yeah. now you're telling me everything about it. Right? You just asked what I thought. So I am. I'm an honest person. <laughs> We're writing. So how many rides have you gotten? Uh, 18. What? <laughs> Are you gonna say this will be 19. This will be 19. 19? <laughs> what? I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. How I can't wait to watch your face. Dude. How do you it's get 19? It's been. It hasn't even technically opened yet. It opens at 9:15. How do you? Just show not, up. It's like ride. 9:15. 11 minutes. Are you excited? Are you excited? Very excited. Are you excited for your 19th oh, ride? Oh, so ready. All right. I'll see you after we ride it. We're riding it. This is crazy. I rode back row, both of, we, she rode second to back. What did you think? That was, it was, it was way better than I expected it to be. Number three, oh, automatically number three. I think the airtime was a little less strong than I thought it would be, so hopefully it'll probably oh, wow. speed up. But it was, I did not, I mean That's that crazy. speed hill, that speed hill was crazy. It's definitely did not disappoint. But I think the airtime was a little weak, but it'll probably speed up. That was crazy though, was I'm crazy shaking. Awesome. I just rode Air Force One, and I cannot believe I just did that. Wow. Okay, this is not a Georgia scorcher. There is no snow in the forecast. The rain is waiting until tomorrow. So I ask once again, how's everyone doing this morning? Oh, the land of the free and the home of the That was actually a pretty cool opening ceremony, wouldn't awesome. you agree? Yeah, yeah I love it. That was it. really cool. So now we're gonna wait in this very long line. We got only one ride. There have been people that got in like 10 rides, but yeah. So now we're gonna ride this a few more times, see how it is. Are you excited? I'm very excited. We're gonna try a front row ride, but yeah, that was a really cool opening day. Yeah. I mean, the, the, the pyro was ceremony. amazing. Yeah. Hey. Who I found. Who are you? Zero G Coasters. Make sure to subscribe. Why am I yeah. counting down? He did a live stream. And I did a live stream of it too. Yeah, it was way better than mine. So go. It was not go that watch. good, honestly. Go watch Doctor Coasters. Yeah, Doctor <laughs> Coasters is probably the best. Oh, for sure. But, I mean, that was that was an awesome opening ceremony. I'm so happy for the park and the ride. Like, we are just minutes Oops. away from uh, getting. Sorry. Our technical first rides, even though I've already done it eight times. First rides of it being open. So, what do you think? I mean, it's incredible. The first half feels like Iron Gwazi and Steel Vengeance, and the second half is like Twisted Timbers. It's just amazing how they did it. It, it really is actually amazing. 
As for favorite element, like the overbank is or the outer bank is pretty good. The stall, I mean, when it's not warmed up, it's amazing. But like the stall, like later in the day, is probably going to be. Like, it's just blast. it lasts forever. It does. The double up is amazing, and but I feel like my favorite part of the ride is the roll over the arcade. It just the laterals and whip you get from it is like almost equivalent to Velocicoaster's Mosasaurus roll. Yeah, I thought the stall was amazing, really good. I mean, it's not my favorite element, but it's still really good. Uh, I thought my favorite element was actually probably the speed hill. I know wow. it's really weird, but it's just, There's it just... There's a like, lot of good, like, airtime hills in the back half. That's Yeah, it was... I thought the double up was a little floaty, a little more floaty than I thought it would be. It was pretty... It was a lot of flow jector airtime. There really was, but again, it hasn't warmed up, so we'll see. Maybe when it warms up, maybe it will pick up. I mean, up. I'm going to be here all day. I got nothing better to do. <laughs> You're going to Six Flags tomorrow, aren't you? I am going to Six Flags up in Georgia. I'm not going to Spring Spring Scream Break, but I'm going to just the, for the day. So, yeah, we're, let's get a few more reds in Air Force One, see how it is. Round two on Iron... I thought say Iron Gwazi. <laughs> yeah, I caught that! <laughs> All right, yeah, round two on Airy Force One. That was crazy. We rode the front row. What did you think? So, like, it was good, but, like, at the end, I got a headache-ish kind of thing in the back of my head. Kind of, at the end. I like it in the front better. You, you like it? No. Yeah. Way better. I mean, we got, I got to ride in the back again. It's insane. Again. But I, I think if that's the way it's going to go, then yes, I think I think the front, the front is better. Is crazy. That was way better. It it's, was crazy. So I said after that that was probably my number three. I'm still sticking with that it's probably my number three. However, it is a lot closer to Velocicoaster now. The way that it just flies through everything is so fast. It's... It, it's my, it's, it, it is amazing. It, it's just incredible. That kind, it's, I, I have no words. It's just, it's a complete ride. So unlike Iron Gwazi, it is more complete. Those two hills right here, these two. Wow, they absolutely launch you to the point where it hurts. It reminds me of Twisted Cyclone's double up. So yeah, Iron, I said Iron Gwazi again. Air Force One is amazing, and so hopefully we can get a few more rides on because we're gonna have to leave soon. We've been here for a while, so hopefully we can get a few more rides. It's just an observation. We're heading back to the car to get some stuff, and it is very full. I mean, it's not really a surprise. It's packed, and the wait is like 30 minutes, but it, it is very full. I almost tripped. Yeah. That will close off our day at Fun Spot, Air Force One opening day. And that was insane. McKaylee. Final thoughts on Air Force One opening day. Um, Z's, um, Z's. Um, it was good and it was my number two. Number two? That is the perfect roller coaster. I'm saying here, 
that is perfect. There's nothing wrong with that. The airtime, the speed, the it's so beautiful and so picturesque. The there's theming in the station. Like it's actually really good looking station. I mean, obviously it's no Disney level, but again, it's not Disney budget. So it's just they have it has everything like for what you'd expect for this kind of park when it comes to presentation and all that they exceeded this is one of the best presentation presented coasters i've ever seen this is seriously the perfect roller coaster there's nothing wrong with it i mean i, I don't really I, I i can't even put into words what it feels like all right as you can see i'm back in the car now because i didn't have enough time to um, finish it while in the parking lot. So I'm in the car and I've had about an hour to just go over what just happened. And I just think that ride is perfect. I can't think of anything wrong with it. It was just, I mean, I think I said this in the parking lot, but there was nothing wrong with it. It was just perfection from how they did the grand opening with the fireworks to the queue. I mean, the queue itself was a little disappointing. I would say I was expecting maybe it not to be as bare bones which they're probably still gonna fix that but the station i was really impressed with the station looked really great i think the operations were a little all oh, right i mean there were like people you know filming you know so they had to like wait for the people who were filming to get, get off the ride set up their cameras stuff like that so i understand that that part had to be part of it so the operations sped up once they finished with the filming but I still think the operations weren't the best. Like, if you were on the stairs, you were going to wait a good maybe 5-10 minutes if you wanted a good row. So, was it an amazing ride? Yes. Excellent ride. I recommend going there before you go to Six Flags. I would prioritize that more than Six Flags. Because that ride is better than everything at Six Flags. And that is honestly like a life-changing experience. It is amazing. So, Mom, what did you think of the day? I loved it. I thought it got better every time I rode it. In fact, while you're riding it, every part seems to just get better and better. You, you think, oh wow, that was amazing, and then before you know it, something else amazing happens, and it's insanely awesome. And Michaela, what did you think of Air Force One? She's so mad again. All right, I'll zoom out then. Um. Oh, he's even getting really close, my face. Um, number two. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's your number two? Uh, what would you rate it? What do you think about that compared to Gwazi? Sorry about that, it's kind of rough. I like rough. it better. I like it better than Gwazi? You see, for me... <laughs> <laughs> It was uh, really, really close to Gwazi. I don't know if I'd like it better, honestly. I can't tell you. It's really close. Iron Gwazi, Velocicoaster, and Air Force One are three rides that I can't, I won't, I, I don't think I can rank them. Like, they're just so close. It's crazy. Overall, it was a great day. Fun Spot did a super great job. Two thumbs up. They did an excellent job at presenting the ride. John Airy, amazing. And apparently, you guys are already looking into building a new ride. More, more rides ready to invest apparently I heard so that's excellent um, apparently also they're retracking mind blower which is great because that ride is a really great layout but it's just so rough that it, it completely ruins the ride wouldn't you agree yes <laughs> I look retract. forward to it being retracked it, the employees there are awesome. There were actually some employees from Kissimmee that we actually met when we were in Kissimmee at Fun Spot Kissimmee. There was one of the managers that was there at Fun Spot Atlanta, and shout out it to was, Scott. Oh yeah, shout out to Scott. He was the guy. He was the guy that I just mentioned. Um, He's awesome. He is awesome. He was so funny. Awesome. He um, was there, there the day that I thought I was going to die. On the Sky Coaster. Because my son got me to ride the Sky Coaster. All right, so... But I'm grateful for it. Let's go over the ride itself, Air Force One. The first drop is it is better than Iron Gwazi's first drop, in my opinion. The Raven Trust dive was a little disappointing, I'd say. I think... I wasn't really expecting much from it, I think. It was great. It was still really good. It was whippy. It just wasn't... There wasn't any airtime in going into it. Which is a little disappointing. On any of the rows, there wasn't any airtime. The speed hill was awesome. The zero G stall. There wasn't any airtime. On the um, Raven Trust dive. Is there was. On the going into the Raven Trust dive, there was not airtime. 
you got out, you did go out of your seat, but it wasn't airtime. It was like a hang time whip mix. It was really weird. The speed hill was awesome. I didn't really feel the laterals though. The stall, honestly, I keep forgetting about the stall. It's awesome, but I keep forgetting about it because everything is just so good. The outer bank is amazing. The double up is amazing. Are you the barrel roll, about the no, the stall is still amazing. I just keep forgetting about it. Honestly, I don't have a favorite part of the ride. There's no, I don't have a best part or anything. Cause it's just all, it's so hard to pick one. It's all awesome. The double up was really good. That drop is so sustained. The barrel roll over the arcade, it, it's just like the Mosasaurus roll on Velocicoaster, but it is, you're in like RMC trains. If you're in an RMC versus Velocicoaster or Pantheon, you'll know that the trains are very different. And then also on Air Force One, you're in like the, it feels like a cage kind of because of the structure. So. Velocicoasters is better because you're just so open, but the fakie airtime on Air Force One actually is like kind of a crazy and it doesn't feel like it should exist. Um, and then the quad down, I always thought, and you know this, that the quad down, I always, I wanted something else, but no, that quad down, it is, it tries to kill you. Like, I don't care what anybody says. Why, why it's, do you say it tries to kill it's you? It's a metaphor, but it, it's, it's just crazy. Like it want it that wants to like to rip you apart. It well, feels it like it tries smooth. to rip you. I didn't you. feel any pain on that ride, which is amazing. The quad down. It felt like it wanted to rip my body in half. And then the brake run. Going into the brake run, you the brake run is very hard. It like it slows. It's pretty. And then, so I always fold it over, because then also you fly up, because going into the brake run, there is a lot of air time. It ejects you. So it's, it feels, the quad down, it does not, it, you think it feels like eight hills. It it feels like it never ends. It just keeps going. So overall, Air Force One is just an amazing ride, and I have no complaints about it. So I think that will wrap up the video, so make sure to, I know this is kind of long, but Make sure to please like the video, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more Air Force One content. I know I've said that for the past like six videos, but if you want to see some more, subscribe. And with that said, please make sure to have a thrilling rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.